Hi. Uh, about last night. First of all, I'm better. That was a uh, episode of bipolar disorder that was going on. I knew it at the time. And uh, when that happens, and that particular one was a dive toward the depressive part of it. Um, many of you have experienced that. Uh, to me, it's, just, it's downright painful when it occurs, and I, I know it'll pass. For me, they don't last terribly long, unfortunately. Uh, but I do need to have help sometimes in getting out of the hopelessness and the, uh, the terrible aloneness that I feel in those moments. So, a lot of you did absolutely step up to the plate for me, and I appreciate that so much. Not only people that I talked to and picked out ahead of time, but people that were even, even new subs to the channel uh, just jumped right in there. And I, I can't thank you enough. Um, a couple in particular that that, uh, that I just I have to thank. Uh, one, uh, Bojay, my god, all those emails and every single word and every single one was perfect. I don't know how you did that. But, uh, but my goodness, you need to go into that for a profession and don't let anybody tell you different. <laughs> you just did perfectly. Um, Pearl, super long email. Uh, you didn't even know exactly what was going on on this end, and yet you said all the right things. And it helped a lot. And I know what it took to write a super long email. So, you were my rock in return. Thank you. Uh, Frida, for the uh, long minutes on the telephone. Thank you. It helped a lot. And uh, there's so many others. I, I could sit here for 10 minutes just listing names, and I'm not going to do that. You know who you are. And every one helped. And I appreciate that. I felt very good afterwards, and that's why it didn't last all that very long. And I appreciate it. But I did learn something. And it was one of the major lessons that I want to learn from this whole thing. Um... One of the things I'm trying to learn on this trip is how to separate what is me from what is not me, from what is the illness. And last night was a very good example for me to look at, to say, okay, this is you definitely under the influence of the illness. What is different? Do you feel differently about this or about that? Is your your mindset different about this or that? And it wasn't. And because of the fact that I was absolutely positively under the influence of my illness last night, I know that I absolutely positively am not today. So I can draw that line in the sand too. I know that what I'm feeling today, what I'm thinking today, is me. On the videos I'll be uploading very shortly, over the next couple of days, I've had a chance to put a lot of me back together that I haven't had together in many years. And uh, I like me. I like me. I came to exactly the right spot. I'm in the... Uh, Huntington Beach, which is a, a kind of a little-known area south of uh, Myrtle Beach, and it's, it's not crowded, hardly anybody knows it's here, uh, I'll be showing you at least one picture of what it looks like on the beach when they're at total capacity, and it's just deserted, uh, and this is what I remember it being like when I was young, because I actually was north of here, about 40 miles, but this has helped bring it home to me. If I had went back to the exact physical place, it wouldn't have really been home. But I went back to here, and this has done it. This has been exactly the right thing to do. Um, anyhow, more that's coming. Hang tight.
hi again again thank you thank you thank you thank you and oh, 